Eat some baby. What's up with it? What's up with it, everybody? It's your boy RDR. Welcome back to RDR Food Reviews. As you can see here, right in front of your face, at the bottom of the screen today. That's right, your boy Artie Rizzle is doing crispy crunchy chicken mukbang. That's right, a crispy crunchy chicken mukbang. Now it's been said that crispy crunchy chicken is the best convenience store gas station chicken in the United States. And I've had it once a long time ago. But uh, I had to get a refresher. So that's what we got here going today to see what it's all about. Uh, if this is your first time coming to RDR Food Reviews, I'm your host, Roberto Del Rio. And this is RDR Food Reviews. I not only do food reviews and mukbangs. I do challenge videos, vlog videos, cooking videos, the works. So if you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button at the bottom. Make sure that notification bell so you can get the latest, greatest RDR Food Reviews. Also, don't forget to check out the coldest water descriptions are below for a giveaway for a high quality vacuum seal water bottle. Um, one gallon, make sure you go ahead and check that out, try to get in when you fit in. Also, don't forget, when you make a purchase, to get 10% off, hit my promotion code, refreshing, refreshing, so you can get 10% off your purchase. It's pretty much your shipping, cutting. So let's go ahead and get a quick moment of press, so we gotta get it while it's hot. Father, bless this food I'm about to receive. Help this food nourish my body, make strong as a person, strong as a man. Bless us or grow home, as I pray to please follow something in your holy gracious mind, and we pray. Amen. Love you, Father. All right, now. All right, so, with the prior out the way, intro out the way, let's dig in. Okay, so, crispy, crunchy chicken cutting. Yeah! Duh. The best convenience store chicken there is. I'm about to get into it. Right here, I got me some, uh, some of the beautiful, dark, um, crunchy chicken right here. I got some of the honey butter biscuits. I don't know what this is right here. I'm going to check that out. Maybe it's a boot in. I'm not sure. I got one of their chicken sandwiches and some potato wedges. I got some mac and cheese and some macaroni and cheese. Uh, I got some mashed potatoes and macaroni and cheese right here. Let's go ahead and get us a quick thumbnail in. Damn, son. Where'd you find this? <sighs> that should be close enough for jazz. Put that out the way. Start like Marvin Cuddy. All right, now, so, yeah, man, crispy, crunchy chicken. Time to get into this bad boy. So, a lot of people, if you haven't heard of crispy, crunchy chicken, now, it's founded in Lafayette, Louisiana. It's more like, that's where it's based is everything in. So, it's like pretty much specialized in Cajun-style chicken, Cajun recipe right here. That right there is a thigh similar very similar you got to uh, Popeyes ish with the Cajun seasoning and fla uh, not flavors that I know of yet but just like the how the tint of the coloration of it is so let's go ahead and not waste no time cutting this right here is crispy crunchy chicken let's get it in Slightly juicy in there. Definitely crunchy. Twenty one. Oh man. You know? Remembrance is coming up. I immediately slaughtered this baby. <laughs> That's some really tasty chicken right there. It definitely has a little added little kick in it, you know what I'm saying? Like some cayenne kick or whatever, but I'm liking the crunch action. Look at this. Mm. Tasty. Definitely some crunch chowder in it. Mm. <laughs> you 
You definitely living up to the first part of your name. Twenty one. Crispy. Which I'm assuming that's what you're priding yourself off of with being called, you know, crispy. And this it. It's crispy, slightly juicy, and it um uh, has a nice mellow flavor to it. Mmm. If you was traveling, you can't stop smashing this game. If you were traveling, and you was in a mood for some chicken, or even if you was in a small town, and you don't have a Popeye's, this would be a fantastic substitute. No cap, Cuddy. Fantastic substitute. This right here, I've heard a lot about the honey butter biscuits. Let's see what this is about. Oh, baby. <laughs> Sugar crush. Look at that. That's like a full moon bite right there. Perfect. Oh, my God. a bit into a like a cakey type biscuit that was unbelievable I'm gonna go ahead and crush myself that was astonishing <laughs> mm. ah, refreshing damn crispy crunchy KKC Doing it like that? Let's see what this is all about. Oh man, yeah, this is a boudin right here. Boudin, man, is a staple in the Cajun region, man. Hold up. Not like an outside on that. Maybe that. Maybe that was left out too long. <laughs> but the rice is very spicy. Mm. Finish her. Thunderous. So far on the chicken cutting is a whistle. You know what I'm talking about? Already. All right. Let's go ahead and try one of these potato wedges. For starchy yet satisfying. <laughs> Winning. It's like everything is embedded with like Cajun seasoning. I like these potato wedges. They kind of remind me a little bit of like KFC. I mean, they switch. KFC switched up, but it do kind of remind me of KFC uh, potato wedges. Let's go ahead and do it. Yeah, man. Like I said, I heard that not only is crispy crunchy chicken is like in Texas and in Louisiana, it's reached all the way out there on the West Coast. And where I got this crispy crunchy chicken at, I got this at a Valero. Uh, so hopefully you got a Valero around your region. Oh man. Let's see, we got uh, their chicken sandwich here, which doesn't really look that appealing. Um, I'm just gonna try it for pride. <laughs> Two pieces of two pickles on there and a chicken fillet. <sighs> Let's see what she does. Mm. Mm. 
Mm. The raw is um the bun is actually surprisingly sweet. Has a nice sweet to a uh, taste to it. But the pickles are so embedded into the into the moisture of the uh bun you can't really taste the tang you know what I'm saying that you would get from pickles and also I feel like I'm tasting nothing but bun it's like the chicken is like totally disappeared it's not really a good chicken sandwich whatsoever <laughs> yeah, pass. All, right. all right let's see what this macaroni and cheese look like that's looking pretty good right there. What you think? Ah, yeah. Got crust juice all over me. Let's see what it do. Oh. That macaroni and cheese. Delicious. Oh, yeah. Very creamy, smooth. There's like a nice American cheese sauce to it. Very smooth. The noodles are very soft. This definitely tastes like 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 it's homemade for like, you know, Thanksgiving or whatnot. Only thing missing in this bad boy is some shredded cheese with a pool. And it'd be in there like swimwear. But it's very good. Macaroni and cheese is a definitely plus. And you know when you go to a chicken joint, you definitely got to try out the mashed potatoes. Get over here! Mm. Mm. Oh, wow. Look at that. Already got the brown gravy on there and everything. Tasty. Wow. Wow. I know this kind of sounds like a three-handed mustard, but Cuddy, these so similar to Church's macaroni, not macaroni and cheese, but mashed potatoes and gravy. So creamy, starchy. That is starchy. Magnificent. It just has a good flavor to it. Oh, man. It doesn't have like an herby taste to it, but it's like got a really nice starchy taste to it. It doesn't have like 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 it's not salty or whatever like that. It's just it's just fine. So yeah, the sides, I'm definitely, I definitely rock with the mashed potatoes. I definitely rock with the mac and cheese. Chicken sandwich is totally trash. <laughs> Denied. But what can you expect? I mean, like I said, for gas station, for gas station, um, it's not, you know, it's just, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? But I'm saying for travel food, you would definitely enjoy this. Chicken is superb, though. I thought I had it in me, man, but I don't today. So, overall, <clears throat> so overall, cutting. <sighs> Triple refreshing. Crispy crunchy chicken cutting, it, it really is legit. It's an awesome substitute, like I was saying. A very awesome substitute. Uh, like if you don't have like a fried chicken chain in your town, and especially if you're a Popeye's lover, this would definitely give you satisfaction. The biscuits are off the chain. Definitely off the chain. Never get the chicken sandwich. Try to get the boudin fresh and hot. Definitely get the chicken when it's fresh and hot. 21. It's crunchy, it's flavorful. 
tender. It has nice juiciness to it. So, they also got shrimp and Cajun tenders and stuff, but I, I passed. Oh, man. This is really, really good. I share this with y'all, but y'all way out there somewhere in the middle of all nowhere. All right, y'all. Let's go ahead and close this bad boy out. That everybody is my crispy, crunchy chicken mukbang. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's your boy RDR, and like I always say, man, hey, look, food is a gift, so please give thanks. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also, don't forget to hit that like button. If you don't like this video, you really don't like my content, go ahead hit it with thumbs down. I'm gonna love it. It don't matter. I'm gonna love you like I always have. It's your boy RDR. I'm signing up out of here. God bless y'all. Take care already. I love you guys, and I'm gonna see y'all soon. God bless y'all, and good night.